say, you can yeah. say something ridiculous and then say feminist theory. Yeah. And they're like, oh, it's in feminist theory. Yeah, yeah that's Fem- the thing, right? Is so much of the stuff they come up with, let me throw them an olive branch. Like, so much of the stuff they come up with is a creative idea. Maybe there's something to some of this stuff, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. But what they're putting forward is hypotheses. And then they're treating them as conclusions. So they're putting forward this idea. I saw one on Twitter today. It was something like, it was about South Park, how it's been laundering racism into society and making everybody comfortable with racism. And that's why everything's so racist and people are shooting Jews is because South Park made it normal. <laughs> oh. But that's a, that, they're treating that as a conclusion, but that's a hypothesis, right? So right. we could test that. It's conceivable that you could actually try to parse out what variables need to be controlled See, yeah. you know, South Park came out, it started doing these themes, what, how does it track? Statisticians can do kind of amazing things with that stuff. But they're not doing that. They're not testing it. And Instead of testing it, right. they're concluding it, and, and then, they're using theory to do so. And they're go, – no, go Yo, no, it's even bigger than that because why don't they test it? Well, if they tested it – and this is – I'm not making this shit up. You won't believe me, but this is true. If they tested it and the test showed that their hypothesis was wrong – they would say that the test was racist, right. that the test is condoning racism, and that's why it didn't give them the desired result. How right. would you test something like that? I mean, I'm not a statistician. I actually am a mathematician, but I'm not a statistician. They're two different things. So I'm not exactly sure how you would test that. But conceivably, you could gather data, survey data, and see how attitudes have changed. Maybe you could track kinds of articles, kinds yeah, of who, events that are coming out. You could kind of pair that up with what's been shown who, on who, South Park. Yeah, who are at South Park and track that with attitudes. I yeah, mean, you but could... no, there's no effort to do this. They're like, oh, South Park presents these ideas, which they then cherry pick because there's other ideas that they don't talk about that are, yeah. you know, point the other direction. These ideas are problematic. That's the big word. Theoretically, that's a problem. Why? Because they, and I'm not joking, they literally believe that use of language creates the power dynamics that define society. So South Park's using language and imagery that creates a power dynamic that makes people more comfortable being racist. (laughs) Boom. Theory. Done. No test needed. No even attempt test. And then if the test happened... The test itself would be racist unless it confirmed the hypothesis. Right. 